this is Rob Goose about the right marketing. And today we're going to show you how to sync your Google and iCloud contacts on your iOS device, like an iPhone or an iPad. And from there, you can then sync either one of those accounts to command via PySync. And we do have separate videos showing how to do that once we get this process done. And that way, all contacts will be kept up to date on all of your different platforms and accounts. So the same contact information will be in command and on your iPhone and in your Google account and wherever else you choose to sync here on your phone. Um, this method can also be used to sync contacts with other services like Outlook.com or some other service that you use. The reason we show this method is because PySync within command only allows one free sync. So if you have all the contacts synced with each other already, you only have to sync one of those accounts in command to have them in command uh, with all the correct information. First, you'll want to open the Settings app on your iOS device. Here I've got my iPhone. You can also do this on your iPad. You're going to scroll down and tap on Passwords and Accounts. On this page, iCloud should already be listed here, but if any of the accounts you want to keep contacts in sync with aren't listed here, tap on Add Account, and then you'll follow the rest of the steps to get that account synced with your phone here. One big note here, your KW email is Google. So if you want to have the contacts that are in your KW email on your phone and in command, you're going to choose that Google option after you choose Add Account. You don't want to do other, choose Google. Once all of the accounts that you want to sync those contacts for are added to your phone, back on the Passwords and Accounts page, you'll want to make sure to tap on each one of those and that the switch for Contacts is turned on. It's up to you whether you also want to sync the other information to your iOS device, but you definitely want to make sure Contacts is synced. Once that switch for Contacts is turned on, that's it. Now you can go to command and sync with any of those accounts using PySync, and then you just be using that one free sync. And that contact information will stay in sync across command, your iPhone, and your Google account. If you do have additional questions about this, feel free to send us an email at support at scottleroymarketing.com.